Hey, it's Naomi Lynn with another Firefighter Friday. Now, this time we decided to come out to the Clinton Fire Department so we could check out all the awesome trucks and emergency vehicles that they have. And I'm actually here with Michael Schoons. Now, you are a junior firefighter, yes. correct? That's because you're younger, right? Yep. So how old are you? 18, uh, 17. 17, going to be 18 yep, soon? in a few months. So what's the difference between being a junior firefighter and a regular firefighter besides just the age? Um, junior, you can't really do much. You can support the scene. You can become scene support. And you can't go into the burning building. You can do many other things, though, okay. like uh, get water for the firemen, change their bottles, do many other things, add a car accident, just clean up around, help the patient Is a little bit, like help the EMT what they need and stuff. Is that what scene support means? Yeah, but most likely in, when you're 17 and 16, you can go and take some of the fire classes like firefighter one, firefighter two. Okay. You get all those and then when you turn 18, you can go inside now, the building. Now, firefighter one, I've heard from other firefighters that we've done interviews, that is like the training for interior yes. stuff, right? Yep. So you can get all your training done well, maybe not all of it, but you can get a lot of your training done at a younger age, so you yes. can jump and then right when into you turn it. 18, you can go inside. Oh, wow. Um, you know, what first got you interested in firefighting in the first place? Uh, it's a family tradition. All right, I know your, uh, we did talk to your brother, David. Yep. Um, so he does it. Your dad does it as well. Yep. My uh, uncle, my cousins. Yep. So everyone. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Pretty much you've grown up around firefighting. Yep come around the firehouse when I was little. Now with doing scene support and things like that already, is there anything that you've seen or done that has maybe made you a little bit iffy about firefighting? Some calls I've seen them like, I couldn't believe that it could happen. Some calls are very different from others. They're never the same. You never know what you're gonna be walking into when you pull up to a crash or right. a fire. Yeah, and It's always different. Nothing has kind of made you go, mm, I don't know if I want to do this for the rest of my life. No, I want to keep doing it. Nice. So what are your plans for the future? You're, you're 17, going to be 18. You know you want to do firefighting. Are you going to stay here? Are you going to go? I'm going to stay around here. I'm going to get my classes and get going and find a job in this local area and run calls when I can. Nice. And get every, all my classes. So. Well, Mike, thanks for joining us today no for problem. Firefighter Friday. And you are one of the youngest firefighters that we've talked to so far. Really? And it's really exciting to see someone young getting into firefighting and knowing that that's what you want to continue to do. Mm -hmm. And for that, we are proud to recognize you and feature you for this week's Firefighter Friday. Thank you.